Hey guys, it's me again. Yeah, wearing the same shirt. I usually wear the same shirt for at least two or three days. <laughs> anyway, uh, I just want to make a quick video that I just recently did some searching and figuring out some things. It was a little bit, my you know, my brain doesn't work as well as most people's. But anyways, I uh, found that there's an emulator called Mensen, or Messen. It's an NES emulator, it appears to be, and it uses something called high definition packs. M meaning it makes 8-bit games look even better than they currently do in their current form. Uh, basically, um, I'm going to show you a just a quick couple levels of uh, this HD pack that I found of Ninja Gaiden. And uh, it makes the game look like the Super Nintendo Trilogy counterpart, but you have the 8-bit music intact. And this is running on an NES simulator. It's really impressive. Uh, there's two... No, I take that back. There's three packs out there that you need to be aware of. You... Um, there's Castlevania, and then there's Ninja Gaiden 1 and 2, and hopefully we'll see more in the future. Because it, be, it would just be awesome to see, you know, NES games look even better than their current, in their current state. I'm not talking like an HD remix or anything like that, because those are garbage. Uh, but, you know, our actual NES games looking great. Uh, so let me just shut up and just show you what it is. It's pretty, it's pretty awesome. Uh... So let me just shrink me here. I apologize for the crudeness of this video. I, I'm just doing this kind of like, I saw this, I'm like, I gotta let my fans know about this shit. So unfortunately, you're probably going to see that toolbar at the very top, because I'm just going to show this real fast, it's just so you can see what this can do. It's pretty cool. So let's go ahead and unpause this. Resume. Can I get rid of that? No, I can't. Okay, there we go. Hold on, let me just see if I can stretch it a little more. There we go. You'll notice that the colors are fantastic. Let me turn down some volumes real fast. Oh, damn. My, my volume just went from that to... Anyways, let me just turn down the volume a little bit. There we go. Of course, it's a story. That's uh, your father can, I guess, fight with Moth. If you haven't played Ninja Gaiden, you need to play it anyways. Anyways, as you notice, the title screen looks prettier. It looks just like the title screen you see in the original uh, Super Nintendo Trilogy game, if you haven't played it. If you haven't, give it a try, but the music sucks. This already looks so much better. Yeah, notice how it looks all clean, crisp, and the way, the way the SNES Trilogy looked. I mean, that game didn't have much of an improvement, but uh, it was what it was. I don't understand why they changed the music, but this way you get to play the original NES game with the music intact, so you don't have no reverbery, remixed garbage. Just going to play a quick couple levels here. Yeah, I noticed my left button on my controller ain't working right anymore. That's kind of, kind of blows. Ah, it's all right. I'll figure it out. Probably just need some cleaning or some shit. Yeah, it looks just like the SNES trilogy. It's crazy. I mean, to see this running on a NES with the extra color and, you know, it just, you know, it looks better. It's pretty neat. I encourage this, so people who are doing ROM hacking of this caliber, please continue to do something like this. I would love to see Blaster Master in this kind of light. That'd be pretty awesome to see that looking pretty. Not a tech horror by any means, but it's just cool to see one of my beloved favorite NES games... Uh, be done and redone in such a way that this looks cleaner and nicer and it almost looks as good as a Master System game, to be honest. And we all know that the power on the Master System beats a shit out of the NES, but the NES had better titles, so, you know, take your pick. It all comes down to software, not hardware, as we've seen during this generation.
I've played Ninja Gaiden, almost said Gaiden, I, Ninja Gaiden so many times, it's just like, almost, almost like the back of my hand, it's crazy. But, that's the thing, it has a flow, and once you learn that flow, this game isn't as hard as everyone makes it out to be. At least in my opinion. Your opinion may vary, and you are entitled to that. I'll, of course, link these in the, what you need to get started in the description. It's just, I always have a hard time playing and talking at the same time when I'm just in a rushed, when my mind just feels rushed. I don't know if you know, yeah. Anyways, fuck it, let's just play. I'll beat this level and call the video. But yeah, it looks great. I look forward to replaying Ninja Guide once again with an interesting new look. Okay, go away now. Bye-bye. <laughs> but yeah, uh, this looks a little cleaner. You know, if you've ever played Trilogy on the SNES, you know, it, it shares that uh, that color palette and the look of it. So there's that. Okay, so this emulator is called messing and what you have to do is when you get the when you get the file you double click on the icon to extract it once you extract it you need to re, uh, make a subfolder and rename it HD packs and what you do is you take the HD packs and you extract it to its own folder and make sure your ROM of the game matches the same as the HD packs subfolder so meaning say if this game was called uh, Ninja Gaiden USA dot uh, the folder was called Ninja Gaiden USA with parentheses. Uh, your ROM has to be renamed that same way, so that way they can interconnect. And this is the end result. <clears throat> sorry for sorry that this video was just you know me playing the game and not talking much, but uh, I just want to let my a uh, few quick opinions of it. I think this is an awesome idea, and I really want to see it thoroughly explored. And I have yet to check the Castlevania one. That one also looks interesting, but. Uh, I'll post, post links in the description of the emulator and where you can get the HD packs, and uh, so you can enjoy this. I mean, what's the point of not enjoying something that is com considered high definition and also remake colors and making your NES games look better? Because, don't get me wrong, Ninja Gaiden looks and plays great, but the problem is, is the colors are a little rough around the edges, to, to, say, uh, to say the least. So... Anyways, this is just a quick video. I hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you on the next one. And make sure you get this shit and give it a try. I think you'll find yourself pleasantly surprised. So, see ya.